I hate a nigga that be acting like they got motion. But no, but really, don't really got motion. Let's <laughs> Merry Christmas. Can you see a first toxic sign? Go ahead and get up out of that relationship. What's y'all take on Hachi? Say you got a boyfriend and he got a girlfriend, though. Mm -mm. If your breath stank, it's over with. It's cheating. not cheating. It's not it's cheating. Not it's cheating. It's what toxic relationship you was in? But I get what you're saying, friend. Hey. Are y'all mature enough to date somebody with kids? No. Yes. Double back until I just don't give a fuck. So you ain't doubling back no more. You quadrupling back. Yeah. A big 500 pound nigga can walk up and if he say he gonna treat you. <laughs> <laughs> Once you mess with a nigga that do this, then you can't. They gotta have a little bit of No new friends, no new friends, no new friends, no no no. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Daisy Lachey, and go ahead and that subscribe button because you're gonna love it here. Period. Okay, so in today's video, as y'all read by the title, we finna be doing like a little girl talk or whatever. And we all just gonna be, you know, asking little questions, just doing like a little girl talk amongst the four of us. I got Jada with me, Taylor with me, and Tay with me. So, yeah. Y'all yeah. names kinda rhyme, Jada, Taylor, Tay. No, they don't. <laughs> no, that's Tay but and Jada, Jada Taylor. Taylor. Yeah, Jada Taylor. Yeah. 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 Hey, I'm gonna start off with um with like a little question, but it's all we all gonna be like just conversing amongst the questions or whatever. The first question I'm gonna ask is, would y'all rather a rich cheating nigga or a um faithful nine to five nigga? Faithful nine to five. Faithful nine to five if he's doing for me like he should be, but yeah. What about you, Jada? It's a faithful nine to five because. I make my own money, so I don't need no nigga for sure. that. So it's just like the money don't matter. Especially not when it's cheating. Okay, no, that's a little too much. I cheating. mean, I don't want no um cheating nigga right either. Right. But time's hard, so it's like <laughs> shit. If he do it for no, me, no, it's shit. just like if you nine to five, like well, it, it depends on what kind of nine to five type shit. Cause like, what are yeah. you making like ten dollars an hour? Engineering nine. Nah, nah, we talking nine to five. Nah, I don't want no man. Yeah. Donald's nine to five. You feel me? I want like a factory nine to yeah, five yeah, or yeah. like a construction nine to five. They gotta be yeah. sun, 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 sun. Cause oh god, okay then. <laughs> what well, they did to you? Cause well, if not, I'd rather really be crying in the motherfucking Maybach or yeah. goddamn Tesla or something. Build my money up and I leave. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, right. for sure. No. That's exactly what I've been doing. Okay, games. pause. Can you turn this light down a bit? Look, that shit burning me. Like, <laughs> it's not that bright. I can't even. Oh God, that bit bright. I can't even see. Go down. That's, that is bright. Damn. No, that's better. That's, that's better than what yeah. it was. Cause while ago, I looked like a white woman on here. Now. Taylor, what? It wasn't bright before for me. It was bright now. Yeah, you drunk. But <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, so boom. The next question I'm gonna ask is, how do y'all feel about long distance relationships? No. I can't do it. I Why? Really can't. Like, Hold on, wait. Hold on, y'all go first. I'm coming. I've done it. Long distance. I've done it. I, I haven't. I um, can't even try it. I know. I need somebody there with me right then. There. That's why I can't do it. Yeah. I mean, right now. I, I can't wouldn't willingly do it again. Like do it again, cause I need somebody like around me. I'm in there doing it. Can't do it. That's like, how I, I know. Feel. I did it. And I just, you know, if you really love that person, it's doable. But would I choose to do it? No. I wouldn't choose to. <laughs> Tell me I just don't love them then. I feel like long distance relationships are hard. Like, I wouldn't choose to do that either off the it's screen. Actually, it's but say if we person. already together, you feel me? Yeah, if we already That's together and then they like kind of like move away. Yeah, I'm not gonna just different. break up with you because yeah, we like, gonna be long that's what, yeah. I, that's what I told myself. I was like, if I was getting a relationship right now and then we go two separate ways to college, but we've been together, say we've been together and we locked in, locked in, and then I'm just, if we can throw that out and come to I don't an know. agreement. Yeah, y'all go to two different was, but, but when you but, go to two different colleges, it's liable to the long distance. I ain't gonna say well, right, that. It's really long liable to long distance. Because, because if you word. think about it, long distance most of the time is between People. military, college, some work or something like that uh like what they call it the drivers or something yeah. like that truck drivers, truck drivers. Yeah. so that's the only time you really just think about long and distance truck drivers be cheap. yeah you got to be a dummy if you think i'm just finna choose a long distance so like somebody <laughs> hit me <laughs> up from like oh, she got <laughs> she got with me going hard then. call the miles and i'm finna just talk to them like no i'm not doing that that's yeah like, so really we all basically long saying long distance relationships I'm, okay, yeah. no, i probably should have yeah. that <laughs> I'm not the right. So yeah, like really we all basically yeah. saying long distance relationship is more so a no than a yes for us. Yeah, yeah basically. Mm -hmm. 
that is um, what is your like number no. one turn off like out of all times since like you just can't come to agreement with if like, your breath stink it's over with for what one. you talk but yeah, yeah. Why, why your hygiene bad yeah. Yeah. i feel like we old enough to be like but i can look at a nigga and tell when they breast mm -hmm. tank but no yeah. nah, nah. Yeah. some of them they might look clean they get up and they get yeah. your yeah. teeth too yeah. i'm yeah. done with messing they, with yeah. yeah what's yours taylor because like really i got so many yeah it's a everything list that y'all name gonna be a turn like, off for me. I know. <laughs> that's how i know this one like if you're like lazy like if yeah. you bully yourself with your life, like oh no no hold on my my number one my number one i realize this is my number one pet peeve i can't stand somebody calling me tween for seven um, but some people might like to be on the phone but what no, i will that's, say that is, if he obsessive I mean, with it i met this dude no. and the first day i met him he was like facetime he wanted to be on the phone yeah, that's, <laughs> that's how he is like, like the first day like, you're, you're like 30 automatic dead <laughs> Why on the If you fully yourself, he I can't. Life. I can't with you. If you he like fully yourself, if eight. you be like you got plenty of niggas, that's gonna really blow me. I mean, you got plenty of bitches, that's gonna blow me because I get niggas just the same way you. Oh yeah, no. Like, no, like oh, I don't care. I get. I get. Who's on the day, y'all? Who's on the day? Here's my song. Like I'm busy. Like. Money, like people call my phone twenty four seven. Okay, why? I told him. I said, why are you call me twenty four seven then? Yeah, like if you you ain't that busy if you able to like, call me like that. That's nothing. I hate a nigga that be acting like they got motion, but don't, but really, don't really got, got motion. Cause you we be knowing, we be yeah, knowing yeah, like, like how they, how they yes, yes, they really, really be like, putting on like, like realize they be, on, like, they be, realize, they be like, work, so working bad. at McDonald's on the low. That's what it be. Burger King, Wendy's. Say he working hard. He's telling you. He got to work hard. So well, like okay, that's so well. And ain't nothing wrong with a nigga yeah. telling me if they working at them spots, but, but don't be putting really on. Yeah, yeah. 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 don't be one of them niggas that put on like you feel me, like you. You that nigga. You yeah. Really got yeah. Like yeah. Okay. What do y'all say the pros and cons of doubling back heels? I go first. No, I let y'all go. Mm. No, I think you should go first. You okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, I believe that like a pro would be. Like we already know each other type shit, like not just know each other personally but physically, all that. So like that that would be the really only Nothing has to be taught. You feel me, yeah, yeah, but like me, I don't really do no doubling back anyway. So I feel like the cons would be you feel like whatever you done did whatever however we broke up, you did that before, so now we're doubling back, you're gonna feel like you can do it again. And then like I just feel like it's gonna give back. you think I'm constantly coming back, like you can get me yeah, back anytime. Every time, you can keep every doing time. That. And that ain't the case. It was just yeah. one double back. And you did it again. Now I gotta go on about my business. It's yeah, simple, like, yeah. Um, but I ain't really trying to do no doubling back. Period. But what y'all think? I feel bad. I feel like when it comes to doubling back, like it's the reason I left you to begin with. Right. So it's yeah. what's the point of me doubling back? Unless we just I always been like to. that. But when you constantly double back, that just creates toxic relationships. Yeah. It's not gonna go as planned. Oh, that's so me personally. My next question. <laughs> me personally, I'm just gonna just like stay where I'm at. Especially if I drop you, I don't care if I like. I'm just stay where I'm at. I get over it. Go on about my business. Cut. Who? My problem is I double back until I just don't give up. So you ain't doubling back no more. You quadrupling back if you yeah. just keep doubling. That ain't no double. <laughs> That's, <my problem. laughs> That's a quadruple. Like, the only good thing about doubling back is just the fact that like you know the person. They know everything about you. Most times you know everything about yeah. them, so it made the you relationship know, easier. My but. best part is I'm choosing to double back but that'd like, be the problem not, like you think it's like you in your head you got an sob in reality you shouldn't even double back because they feel like I don't, and you I'm saying to, you keep going to, you keep going too. back till you just don't give for no more but it's like they feel like they can do that and mm. now they making you not give for it shouldn't even people be like, that. like that is that is they be niggas be thinking they be like she gonna come back anyways that's what they be thinking and so you stand on business and let them know like no, you finna come begging. That's what it is. Or I'm not coming back. I'm still not finna come back. Yeah, I'm finna, I'm finna, I'm finna like really it's look like at you. It's a little bit for me to actually come back. Like, I ain't, I I ain't going back. I, really I gotta. Back back I, gotta no more. Like, I might have to get. I just wanna spice my life up. I might just hey, hey boo. Yeah. Happy Thanksgiving. I'm good. I might need to hit one of them. I can't hold you. No, but I ain't hitting over. No, I ain't hitting over. Wait till Christmas. Merry Christmas. That question kind of leading me into this question. What is y'all take on toxic relationships? I ne I won't do. I won't do another toxic relationship. I won't. Like if I fall in a toxic relationship, I'll put myself back so fast at this point because I know. I'll, like I know the signs that I've 
I've seen. If I see one of the signs I see, if I feel like I'm in a toxic relationship, I'll pull back. What toxic relationship you was in? <laughs> I feel like with Jazz, I was in a toxic relationship. <laughs> but y'all wouldn't. I thought you said y'all wouldn't. That's in a relationship. No, okay, man, we gonna come back. <laughs> Cause that be like, that be adamant again, to that like doubling you, back. You and your ex. Yeah. So with I mean, me, wait, no wait, no with double it, it kind of depends on what. Like, if y'all ended up off like good terms, and it was just like some um, y'all just need to give each other space type shit. Like, I feel like it might be okay to double bit in that in that yeah. sense. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. That's but like most of the time it do be like I feel like most of the time relationships do end on a bad note and I feel like that yeah. toxin is becoming with doubling back because now like and that shit it's cute. getting worse and worse and so, worse. So it's getting really more toxic and more toxic and more toxic and you really probably not need yeah. seeing the signs but it's getting toxic. Yeah. And I would with say me everybody say it's cute, but like some people think that shit's cute, like yeah. y'all just being like funny, funny. Yeah. Like, Until you fuck around and, and you have a black eye walk around here. Yeah. To like I'm not yeah, overly excessive because that it's gonna get to the point where well, he, he be done yeah. put his hands on you or something like that. So me, yeah. honestly, I ain't putting up with that toxic relationship. I'm, I'm Just like you said, when I see a sign of a toxicness, I'm oh, no. gone. Yeah, yeah. I've been, been in a toxic hands, relationship and it was just like he could talk to other people, kind of thing. I could and like it was a it, the toxicness turned into controllingness. And, and, and yeah, then that turned into that manipulative. Listen, listen. Hmm. Between what toxic and like, controlling? Like, sorry people think that shit is cute. But it's not. It like if a nigga be trying to like control so you, like you're not going nowhere serious. or you're not wearing. You it. can't wear this. Yeah. What you mean? I'm, you that's, that's you that's insecure. Toxic. That's toxic. Because if I'm your girl and if you trust me enough, you can I should be able to go out any type of way. Wearing whatever. I yeah, want to wear. I mean it's different if you worry about dudes. That's when you like when the dudes come. That's when you say something. But you need to trust me enough when somebody walk up to me, or approach me, I can say I got a boyfriend or yeah, yeah. whatever the a case lot may of be. Don't know the difference between how like where the deficiate at. So it's like the what? <laughs> <laughs> I think she meant deficiate. That's exactly what she meant. That's exactly what she meant. I was like, what? <laughs> But I get what you're saying, friend. I ain't get what you like, I ain't get it. Okay, y'all knew. I'm crying. Okay, but at the same time, a lot of people wanna know like the difference between the two. So I think, oh, that's just them being cute. Like that's just our relationship. Whole time is toxic as fuck. The the fifth the fifth free eight. That's what she No, different. I was like, I was thinking about the word. Like, what was she trying to say? Then especially nowadays, like for real for real in twenty twenty three. Even though we is going into 2024, but that's why y'all need to open your mouth and open your eyes a little bit more. Because yeah, so many like young females and stuff was getting killed by niggas that supposedly love them. Like that's not yeah, love. Shot by their baby we talk about that, that. We talking about Just when we say young, we talking about like 13, 14 year old. They getting shot Mind by their boyfriends you. and stuff like that. Like what? Y'all just middle school. Not because that shit better father don't mean he ain't gonna kill you. For real. That's another thing. By these niggas and don't think that just because you got you. a child by this man that it's not toxic because y'all got no range. I'm heavy on the if you don't want me or you don't want to be with me, go ahead and go on about your business because you don't know. And I'm heavy stay. on the like, oh, when you see a first toxic you. sign, go ahead and get up out of that relationship before you end up around here beat up a dead for real, for real, for real. Better yet, or killing somebody trying to defend yourself. Either or one to three. Yeah, because baby, that's how I was feeling. I didn't want to be in jail about some shit I was just trying to get out of for real, for real. For real. Okay, so. Um, are y'all mature enough to take to date somebody with kids? No. Yes. Here you go. I don't know. I'm kind of tired at the same time. No, no, no. I ain't never planned to date my own. I ain't got no kids to raise my own. I'm lying. I talked to somebody that had a child. I didn't. I did too. I don't want to step mom wrong. It's just a baby mother coming. I ain't. Y'all to my step mom, but just because a nigga got trained, I mean, I'm gonna automatically be the mother for step mom. But that's just me, like. I feel I like if I'm in love with you, like I'm not in love. Yes, you gotta be trying. If you in love with a nigga, you gotta be definitely turn. Yeah, like you yeah, gotta yeah. be. That's what I'm. That's but what I'm referring to. Not just nine you feel me talking to him, mm -hmm. trying to mm -hmm. figure out where things gonna go. I like, had a nigga leave me the place stuck there. Ever since then, I was heavy on. I never. Yeah, do it mind, I feel like they like the baby, and baby daddy be fucking still. For, for sure. Like, for why? sure. For sure, that's yeah. my main thing. Like, so when she dropping the say, kids off, is she really dropping the kids off? Is y'all hurting? Yeah, yeah. She's yeah. Like some of that daddy, job too. How he feel about baby mama? He say he hate her. He oh, they love her. Yeah, I don't. Oh, why? Wow. Yeah. Why he love her? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I'm a witness to this shit right now. <laughs> and then they used to say I attract baby daddies, but now it's Taylor. But anyway, <laughs> but anyway, but anyways, 
Like for real, for real, for real. Niggas still be fucking with their baby mamas. They and if they got a child that's fresh, they for sure still fucking. Oh, but they don't even. Yeah, yeah, it's for shit show. But that don't even really matter if the child fresh or not. The child can be 10 years old. Oh, I'm on they still fucking mm -hmm. with their baby mama. That, that, that's their baby mama. Mm -hmm. Like, they got a child together. They still gonna be fucking okay. with their baby mama. So it's like, Until I feel like I'm a child enough to date, date somebody with kids. But at the same time, don't play with me. Don't, the, don't with let me. your baby mama ever try to be funny. Yes, I mean, that's another thing, dog. Like, mm -hmm. you got to keep your baby mama in her place. Bitter. Yes, yes. And if you already know your baby mama bitter, if you already know your baby mama still got feelings for you or whatever the case may be, she really shouldn't you have feelings for you. Baby mama, your, baby, your baby mama know you cheating on her, but she's still fucking with you just so she'll have a one-up on everybody else, mm -hmm. even though she looks silly as fuck. Silly. Hold on. That is That's sad as fuck. Hold on. Do better. You must tell somebody this person. I am. <laughs> I almost said their name. Oh, oh. <laughs> basically, I feel like a nigga should be able to keep that baby mama in place. Like that's, that's your baby what mama. Can do. Yeah. So and then that's what gets me. Like I feel like to. I'm mature enough to date somebody with kids, but you also got to be mature. Your baby mama need to be mature. You got to be, be mature. Yeah. And and them kids need to be mature. Cause I'm be telling your mama I'm stealing your fruit snacks, but then I'm just them. <laughs> <laughs> Then I'm be saying, I ain't never heard nothing like that. <laughs> Mama, she be eating all the snacks. <laughs> for real, for real, though, because I'm trying to be missing too. They sure they they definitely do. Because <laughs> y'all date somebody that's like going to be locked up for a long time. What the fuck? Like, what? You. I was just like, bro. Like, for a long time. looking at this oh. thing, man. <laughs> Oh. Don't be laying in my lap. Yeah, I'm gonna lay in your fucking lap. No, 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 you got, you said, oh, like you had it, girl. Hey, okay, don't don't leave it too far. Right, you. Yeah. Push me all the way back on tape, please. No, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. I got a question. It's a simple question, though. Okay. <laughs> um, what's y'all type? You got to treat me good. So you would go with anybody? No, oh, bitch. Hey. So a bitch, a bitch, you good. A bitch, five hundred pound nigga can walk up, and if he say he gonna treat you. <laughs> Go with you gotta be athletic, tall. I do like athletes, y'all. Um, I don't know. I attract baby daddies real bad. Real bad. I that I attract drug dealers real bad, <laughs> and construction workers real bad. Damn, like, just say you attract any type of nigga. Hole. No, I attract girls. I attract boys, those so. three real bad. Yeah. It's like. <laughs> I don't know. I don't just go for That's not singing y'all type. I'm trying I don't to have a type. type. I, have I have a type. A, have a you know what your type is. is. Tall. That's they don't have type. to be, uh, they just can't be light skinned. Your teeth got to be can't look, be look decent. Um, You have to be athletic or not even athletic. You got to be doing something. If you you got to have fit. a little bit of money. Um, you gotta be like a little love boy. You can't be, if you got hoes, you immediately knock the picture because I don't even do that. Yeah, that's pretty. That ain't pretty much it, but like, I have to see that's you to really tell. Yeah. yeah, my type really. I like dark skins, point blank. Period. I'm already light enough. You both definitely <laughs> gotta have pretty teeth, and don't think just because I got these braces, I had good teeth before I did. Oh, and I did. I ain't finna. You, like <laughs> you gotta be a trick. You gotta be a trick for sure. Oh God. When you trick, I'm a trick harder. Um. And you gotta have. You gotta be mature and have some morals about yourself. Like I hate a. Doing too much, more. nigga. Yeah, like for oh, real, for real. something I can't stand. I used to not be like this, but once you mess with a nigga that do this, then it's just like something. You, your nails gotta be dead. You probably like what? But yo, I like you that got, too. You gotta, your nails gotta be clean. I like that cause too. like you finna be, I don't like, like no dirty fingernails. Cause my nails gonna always be dead. So don't think you finna be. Yeah, and your nails dirty. Dirty. Mm -hmm. That's giving very much Period. nasty mm -hmm. infection. Mm -hmm. What's your type, Tay? <laughs> I'm gonna say I have a preference because you know she said it. anybody who treat her right. right. Not anybody. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying what you said. I do attract. I good still be like a ghost. I don't be liking no fine, fine, too fine folks because mm -mm, that's just gonna make me. Yeah, you can't. So they be gotta too have a little good. bit. You gotta of have a little possum. Just a little possum. <laughs> like, like, I want to see his possum. You know how ugly a possum is, bitch. Uh, but I love it. They don't need to be full. Just a little tad possum. I'm crying. Maybe part of the tail or something. But not to be of on the possum. Um, I really like athletes. I love being a supporter. So would y'all date a white boy? I'm not no. racist, but would y'all date a white boy? No. <laughs> Taylor. Never ever. It's giving racist. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 never. 
I mean, I dated a white boy in middle school, but I wouldn't date a white boy nowadays. Like, I, I want my man chocolate. I, I want my man the color yeah. of this seat. Mm -hmm. I won't even fuck with a white dude. Why? I just want my culture real bad. I just can't, like. Yeah, it. like, it's, it's too much racism. Right to, but, like. so bad. Mm -hmm. I can't do it. I just love being black. You know? And I really don't even count the relationship I was in for real, for real. I ain't seen no white yeah, meeting under it. So. Middle school relationships don't count. Them. Yeah, I'm glad it don't. Really, none of my relationships in high school counted. Do y'all see myself getting married? Yes. Yeah. But I don't want kids. I want kids, though. Like, I can see myself pregnant more than I can see myself. I ain't gonna lie. I can see myself pregnant more than I can see myself married. Really? Like. Oh, oh my. That's like, it sounds weird, but I can see myself pregnant. Mm. <clears throat> I don't, I can't I'm trying to have a real before bigger, I carry a baby. I get that, but like, I can say it's a bigger picture than mm -hmm. yeah. I don't want no baby dad. I need a husband. I need, I want a husband. Do y'all feel like people that's like, that's had like miscarriages or like abortions, if you know like how you say have, not having kids is like a blessing and they take that to the heart and be like, well, some people that don't, can't have kids, like, do y'all agree with it? Like, what, I feel like. Mean? Like, like what? What? what like, you what's your question? Like, yeah. Okay. Like, do y'all agree with abortion? That, what you asking? No. No. Like, oh. Do y'all agree that like they should feel some type of way? Yeah, with... they should feel some type of way because Ooh. they experienced like a bad pregnancy or like a miscarriage or like they went I through mean, an abortion. I mean, me hard. personally, I would feel some type of way. Yeah, I, I, I'm not saying that, that. I would feel. I mean, anybody would feel some type of way. I would, but like, I to that. answer your question, basically, I feel like. Everybody life is different. Is, though? Like, no, like I'm okay. I'm, I'm finna answer her question because I know what she's asking. But like I'm everybody, finna I'm finna answer her question because I know what she's asking. Explain it. I feel like like everybody life is different. So like, okay, some people yeah you can't have kids or whatever. But like that's your struggle. You feel me? But other people they're they're proud to not be able to have kids. But even if they oh, did okay. go have an abortion, like. Them people was able to do that, like, and I kind of feel bad, you know what I'm saying, it's, that people can't have kids if you're one of them people, but it's like, you can't be mad at somebody else for not wanting to bear with a child right now, and they might not be able, they might not be ready, anything, like, mm -hmm. but I don't like the fact of bragging about abortions because that's really killing the child, you feel me? But it's like, you can't be mad at other people just because you can't have child, like, you can be sad yeah. within and all this and that, but you cannot be mad with other people, like, that's them people's choice, everybody got their own choice, like, what you know what I'm saying, freedom of speech. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get no answer now? I get, I the get thing it. about when it comes like some people everybody got their reason for everything <clears throat> right so like say a 13 or 14 year old girl gets raped and she ends up with a baby if she knows she she's still a baby herself she knows she can't that might be what she have to do so you can't be mad at her that oh she gave up the baby or no you can't be mad at that and just because you can't have kids and feel some type of way yeah. i mean you can but you honestly can't because you don't I feel like you can't be upset with somebody else unless you know their situation because of your health problem right but really i feel like they be mad because people be bragging like, oh, I got an abortion. Oh, I'm gonna yeah, I don't like nothing like that. I don't like that either. Because it's like you just using from. it as birth control or something like that. You should Or you just really killing babies. Yeah. And people really out here can't even have babies. You feel yeah. me? But if you get an abortion, or you can have them and stuff people like can adopt them or something like that. I think that's what people that can't have kids be looking at it as. To each their own. Tell us what? To each their own. To each his own. Each to his each own. Their own. <laughs> <laughs> Love and hip hop. Love and hip hop. Amina, she wanted to have kids. Peter, he didn't want to have kids. So she was like, You need to get your tubes tied. Neo, he told his ex wife she need to get her tubes tied. A tube tie, like, you can't, like, really reverse that. But vasectomy, you can reverse. So, why, how do y'all feel about your significant other is telling you you need to get your tubes tied rather than them getting vasectomy, which they could reverse, which is harder for you to reverse. You get your tubes tied because you really that's can't. selfish. Yeah, and if she don't want to get her tubes tied, yeah, she don't have to. Because that's, that's your body, body and you do my what you body, want with yours. Yeah, yeah, my body, my like me, your ex wife. She got her tubes tied now. She's remarried. She can't have kids with her new Yeah, husband. yeah, see, mm -mm. I would have never done that. How would y'all go about telling? Say a homegirl or something about their hygiene. How do y'all feel? What's y'all take on hygiene? Period. I have a homegirl. That was. <laughs> <laughs> um, she ain't never been stank, but she was stank one time. Yeah, I just didn't know how to tell her. Like, I don't know. Like, it, she wasn't stank, but her breath was stank. Put it like that. It was her breath. But I ain't, honestly I ain't know how to tell her because like me and this homegirl. We was really close. 
Like real, real close. Like real, 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 real close. That means you should have been able to tell her. Yes. But I just didn't know how to tell her because I've ne that's never like that's she, her birth ain't never been spanked before. So I'm just like, I, I wonder how this person gonna take it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I, I ain't want to you know. hurt feelings and Going I ain't want her to think I was trying to. Going back to the side. Like, she was going home, home, so it wasn't no big deal. I guess it was mm -hmm. like she's going to start some wheels and um, <laughs> somebody else would have felt. Like, <laughs> hygiene like, is a big old thing, like for real, for real. And females, males too, but females, I feel like we got to be like on our P's and Q's with our hygiene and like. Even not even just a friend or a homegirl, but just like females, period. I ain't gonna say it rude or nothing like that, and I don't suggest nobody to say it rude because that's embarrassing. But let them know, like you feel me, you you need to you feel me. I don't know like how <laughs> to say it, cause say, yeah, me y'all know me. Yeah, I be saying stuff straightforward, so I I think y'all should say how y'all would see it on here. First, I would address if they on a period or if they just got their period. That is like true that. too. And or if you what, period finna come like, on yeah, one of those. You tell me like, hey, I'm on my period. Okay, cool. If you say no, then I'm just gonna be like, like you got a little older, like you know, I don't know, you might, it might be a little off down. I really tell what you, you then you find out from somebody. I don't else. know, but I just want to tell you before, yeah, before somebody else and being talked about real bad. You, know what you saying? Yeah. yeah, and I feel like they need to take that as help. And not yeah. you being funny or embarrassing them day, especially if you put them off to the side. Because like, as like as this as between me yeah. and you, touch you. If it's like you're pulling off to the side because like. I didn't tell you for anybody else. Yeah. Right, right. Don't don't do that. If somebody's faint, don't don't tell don't, them in front of a whole bunch yeah, of people. Yeah, that's just that. rude. Okay, I say like you with your significant other, and y'all been together for a little minute, but they got a homegirl or a homeboy. They're not that Jada. <laughs> so they got a homeboy or homegirl, right? Okay. Say that homeboy, that homegirl start liking you. Do you expect your significant other to cut that person off because now feelings involved with that other person, or or do you like accept them to still be their friend? No, knowing no. that they like that, like like your person. Oh, I got a question. Oh, oh yes, but I'm gonna answer. I just thought about it when she no, said that. Fuck, come on. No, you gotta cut them off because yeah, that's like just saying. Like, you feel like it's cheating if they don't. It's not cheating. cheating. It's, not it's not cheating. cheating it's just weird. weird. Wait, wait. I thought you said that the homegirl, the homeboy, start liking you. Yeah, I that's did. What yeah. That's oh, what you mean? Gotta be cheating. I think because you had he started seeing or, you or because they still the gonna be around you. So that's the thing. It's gonna just be awkward yeah, like, if they around you. Off? Yeah, you just should know. cut them off. Mm -mm, I'm that ain't cool. What's going on? But even I feel like not they homeboy, homegirl, yours. I'm a oh, question. Question. I'm, I'm a lost on your question. Okay, it was a little bit of everywhere. Yeah, I feel like yeah. I feel like you should that should you should cut them out. I was trying to. I am thinking you talking about the the, home, the, the, the the significant man, other. No, your homeboy. Okay, I'm gonna cut them off. Yeah, I have that choice. Cause it's like at that point I feel like that is cheating if you know they got feelings for you yeah, and then they gonna I mean, they gonna try yeah. you at every chance they get. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. Yeah, I was. That's the question I was. I was confused. Sorry if I confused y'all, but yeah, that's that's. <laughs> it, went, it went like four different four directions. Damn, Ooh. you two, did y'all know what I was asking? <laughs> No, y'all got confused too. Then y'all. Okay, how do y'all feel about messing with a nigga that got a girlfriend? I'm Would y'all do it? Would y'all do it? So basically, no. This is a topic about <laughs> being a side piece. Basically, <laughs> no. Uh, yes, no. Say you got a boyfriend and he got a girlfriend, though. Mm -mm, don't be encouraging that on this channel. Uh -uh. <laughs> that's, 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 that's cheating and that's being a side chick. You don't want to be with them. Green Hold on, pause. We, we, I, I haven't, I haven't Person. did that, but I was just curious. It <laughs> just made me ask. Yeah, no, the mac and cheese is style, but and we ain't no side. And matter of fact, since we're on the topic of side pieces, yeah, don't be no side bitch, like for real, for, for real. It's, not it's worth so it. many fish out here. It's so many niggas, so many bitches. It's like whatever Pick you deserve. Fish. Yes, go get your own. Single fish. You feel me? So but don't sweet. get mine. You feel me? Because my motherfucking fish. That's my motherfucking fish. Yeah. yeah. I find no uh, well, I can't <laughs> swim, so I won't be catching no fish. I can't swim. My can swim to me. I can swim. I'm. I'm gonna just have to float. Yeah, don't be no side bitch. Like, it's what? Well, I mean, whatever floats your boat for real, for real, for real. But I just don't encourage uh -uh, you to be uh -uh. no side bitch. Whatever floats they boat. But I'm gonna tell them what I don't encourage them to do. Like, I feel yeah, like that. that's like no, that's, that's not right. Immoral. That's not right. And then that's like it make you look bad as a female because you know he got a girlfriend and you still trying to talk to him. It was just a general question. That's definitely Lauren, honestly, Lauren, but no, nah, it's not right at all. Hey, so how y'all feel about girl code? Like, what's y'all um advice on girl code? If I tell you something, it shouldn't be what we talk about. Facts. Yeah, and That's if we fall out, you shouldn't go. You shouldn't go to spill that tea out. Oh, mm -hmm. and if you tell my business after we fall out, you a lame ass. Yeah, you been telling my business. Yeah, and you been envying me. Mm -hmm. 
So. Like for real, for real, for real. You gotta peep who your real friends is and who your real friends ain't because you take the signs. Is. If they show you signs, that's take why them. I only talk to a certain people. I only a talk handful. to a certain You can't have too many friends for only real. Only a certain people Somebody know hating. everything that's going yeah. on with me. Somebody hating. Show. Somebody definitely hating. And that's she also show. another thing about that is that's I don't have to worry about it, but. I know if my business is out because only a certain people, only a certain amount of people know what I got going on. That's why I don't worry about that. And that's why you know who told it. It's not told. Yeah. yeah, real shit. I don't have to worry about that shit because but I know the, the people I told ain't telling shit. And I'm gonna say with the friends I got now, I already know like nothing ain't leaving. Whatever I tell them, but you gotta know your friends. You yeah. can't just be knowing them for and a couple of weeks and feeling like you can tell them you the whole. Another thing. Yeah, you don't I'm know them. I'm gonna tell for my friends, real. but I don't like their friends. But I don't trust their friends. Cause it in the day somebody else gonna see the sound before you do for real, for yeah, even though you should, true. but that's how it be. Like I said, cause I know else. I had a situation where I know Daisy saw me. Yeah, no. Like I, it's a, it's been a situation where Daisy told me like yeah no. Oh, and I didn't realize about somebody? it. Yeah, I didn't realize yeah. it, but then like turns out she... oh this bitch right. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. So like that's why I said shit. Very much serious. I'm just doing that friendship <laughs> stuff, honestly. So I ain't gonna. I'm just, just me personally. I figured out it's really it's good to have a good friend, friend. But yeah, friend. Friend. just not hold not it down not with not the people. Not but not but not say not down with that one. So I say no new friends, no new friends, no new friends, no no no. But it's just good to kind of like if you only got to stick with the old ones, it's no solid or just rock by yourself. I don't learn to be by myself. It's okay to be by yourself. It get lonely sometimes, but like. You get over it when when you, you really in, when you chasing that bag, when you getting you money, when you doing all that, you won't even realize like, like oh no dang, friends. I ain't even wrong nobody. Like dang, I done cut everybody off or dang, I ain't even text these people back because you so busy or so in locked mode. in like you in that mode. I really didn't like that. I've been doing that, so it's like it really worked. Okay, make your boom. Funions, make your money so you can have fun. Period. Help this world. Thank y'all for tuning in. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on the post notifications so post you know every time she drop a new banger. <laughs> new banger. <laughs> exactly. And share with one of your friends. Matter of fact, share with two of your friends. Matter of fact, share with four. Three. I think you should share with all of them and your family <laughs> and your grandma and your mama and your auntie. Hey, because why not? Okay. They need this girl advice for real, for real. For real. We got we y'all some pointers in here for real. Like about a whole bunch of different stuff. So share it for real. For, for real mm -hmm. and subscribe yep. and, and drop comment. that fuck nigga if he being toxic drop him like him you too, and get in your bag and in your business and not your feelings and got in my bag yeah. what you talking about oh you gonna stop oh yeah yeah okay okay I hey, did not okay, body okay, at the okay, okay. no Taylor <laughs> <laughs> did he have that to do with it I'm kidding he have nothing to do with it okay 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 Okay, 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 okay. Get on the fence and get your bag. 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 Eh, eh, eh. Back in my bag. Eh, eh. What's that? Back in my bag. Eh, eh. Back in my bag.